Now, Shasta County has been dealing with a surge in COVID patients over the past few weeks. Now, with almost 100 people in Shasta County hospitals right now, nurses are tirelessly working to save lives. Action is now reporter Ryan Caney spoke with nurses and staff members at Mercy Medical Center in Reading to hear how they are dealing with this recent surge. And basically for us, the nurses, it's like working in a war. Registered nurse Casey Corvette says like a military unit, the nurses at Mercy Medical Center in Reading have become closer, helping each other get through this recent surge. We really love each other and support each other. Makes it easier, easier to bear. Staff is being spread thin as nurses are taking on extended shifts of 18 hours. Some of the staff are sick themselves, leading to nurses being more worn out than ever. People are tired and it's, it's hard to watch people come in that are sick and trying to help them when family cannot come in and visit. With families unable to visit, ICU nurses like Corvette are left to help patients say their final goodbyes from a screen. Recently, I helped a man say goodbye to his wife. He decided to go comfort care. He couldn't bear it anymore. And I was able to reach her by phone and he said goodbye and he loved her. And she, the same for him. And it is a huge privilege to be there for that, but very difficult. Nurses like Josie Hall are trying their best to make it through each day, using mindfulness techniques to help prepare for the long shift ahead. I definitely have found myself having to do a lot more kind of like mindfulness and when I'm on my way to work I have to do a lot more intentional kind of thinking about how am I going to make this day good even if X, Y, or Z happens related to the pandemic. Those techniques can only do so much when patients are looking for comfort or answers nurses don't have. They literally will look at you and say I, I'm not ready to die. I don't want to die alone in this hospital and that's a huge, I mean you just it breaks your heart. Most of the COVID patients at Mercy Medical are unvaccinated. Infectious disease physician Dr. Matthew Miles told me many patients are changing their tune about the vaccine after being hospitalized. I deal with a lot of these patients and you look at them because by far and away the majority in the hospital are unvaccinated. But I could tell you also the majority of those patients have a lot of regret on their faces for not getting vaccinated. That was Ryan Caney reporting of Dr. Miles and other hospital staff members urge everyone to be vaccinated so more people don't end up in their care.